pretty much. Look what happened. I chased all of them. There's, there's no time limit on this one for no reason. I don't know why. But I'm actually still in the... I managed to take down like the first three with almost no time between them. And now I'm just chasing after this one. And this is the final one. But we've seen me chase the third one through here. So, you know, I'm actually... Come on. So close. There you go. Done. Why did I go chase after it then? <laughs> Whatever. I do like the fact that she calls him Hero, then calls him Jack, and then calls Daxter Orange Lightning. No one calls him Orange Lightning. We are quite close to six mission though, so I guess we'll do that in this part. Hopefully if it fits. Hey Sig, my boy. There you are. I was beginning to think you chickened up. I saw an eco crystal in this place, and it's yours if you want it. Trouble is, metalheads have been spotted here in mass. But we wouldn't want those nasty boys to just move back in here without a welcoming party, would we? Let's go give them a big surprise. Hmm. Six thing. I'm not sure if you actually get to keep this or not. But whatever. Gonna take down some metalheads with Sig, just like the old days. Why send them at me again? Because last time we just ran them all over. Plus, Sig's gun is auto targeting, so it's much better than any other gun in the game. Well, any other vehicle's gun in the game, really. The Bouncer doesn't have a gun, it's more like a RPG, which is good. But you know. Come on. Um, we're gonna shortcut. That, that didn't work as a shortcut. Sadly. Actually, no, yeah, it did. A little bit. Because Six Car is pretty much a monster truck. So I can go up these edges. Get off the car. They can do a lot of damage to your car if you let them keep on, but you can just run them over. Ooh, metal beads. I'm happy about these metal beads, because. Oh, come on, drive. Now don't stand still. Just drive, and you'll get him off. That's one down. That's payback for um, the stupid cave mission I had to do. You know what I'm talking about if you've watched Jack, my Jack 2 LP. If you haven't watched it and you're just picking up Jack 3, okay, maybe you might want to go check that out. That's only if you enjoy me as an LP. -er. If you actually hate me as an LP, -er, then never check it out again. In fact, what are you even doing here if you hate me as an LP? -er? We're over there. Stop firing at me. Ah. This is where I remember them being annoying. It's gone. It is dead. Don't tell me it's almost dead. It is dead. I blew it up. Out of my way, tiny, jumpy, honey thingies that I don't have a name. I'm probably thinking you're like the mini ones, I don't know. You were here before. You hit, hit more than one. I ain't gonna drive.
Ah, I'm gonna like one, two shots will destroy it. Where are you? There we go. This away. You sending me back where I was before? No. Yep. Yep. You are. That's pretty daft. <laughs> Come on, we could do this one. Ah, oh, what if I hadn't gone up then? I probably would have beaten him. I'm there. There you go. Final one's apparently back where I came from again. Come on, we don't want to get stuck on stuff because they'll try and leap on me. They're harmless when you're not moving, but if you stop or you crash, they'll try and drain your life like crazy. So overall, I still managed to do some damage to it. Ah, oh, get off, get off, get off the vehicle. I did a lot of damage though to it. Boom, baby. Like eco crystal, mine. Now we just gotta get out of the cave. I'm pretty sure I'll, this is where we get a cutscene where we drive out with Sig. We're like in the car and Sig's driving and we're talking to him. At least I think so. None of you belong. This is pretty daft. Did it do. What am I going to do for my next LP after this? Because I've pretty much unofficially decided that, well, I've decided that I'm not going to do Jack X, at least not for a while. If I feel like giving it a whirl and uh, playing it, I could LP it, but otherwise, it's not really the same. It's more driving like these missions, except it's like proper arena based. Here we go. He drives for you. Is Sig still in this? New secrets! Um, okay. What are these secrets? Because we all know Andrew loves his secrets. Oh, yes! Upgrade vehicle toughness. Is that it? Yeah, by the looks of it. Table jibber. See, I might buy them, but we'll see. I believe that one is infinite boost, which is very useful. Okay, let's check this map. Mm, no, you've taken off all the things because I'm still sick. Okay, let's return back. What was that saying? Oh yeah, Jack X, not playing it because it's different. It's like, have you ever played Ratchet and Clank? Ratchet and Clank has Gladiator. And that's more arena based combat, but it keeps the diversity of missions up, but I mean Jack X is kinda like that, but it's all vehicle, there's no platforming anymore. 
It's like a sub game. Actually, a funny story is, I was listening to the Insomniac podcast and they said, we made Ratchet Gladiator because we were going to make a Ratchet and Clank racer, but Naughty Dog were already making a Jack racer, so they were like, we can't do that. But, as a little nod to each other, I mean, there's the Ratchet and Clank course in here, but you can unlock Ratchet and Jack X, and you can unlock Jack in Ratchet Gladiator, just as a nice little nod to each other. Lieber, I need to find some very special precursor artifacts, but I'm running out of time. Wait a tick. I just traded a very rare artifact indeed to a nice band of metalheads. It was an ugly piece of hardware. It looked like a dog's breakfast to me. But those toothers paid handsomely. They seemed nice enough. Good ivories they had, you know, if you dig fangs and claws. I bet if you crank up that donk, you and the offsider just might be able to catch him. How's right? Jack, you get on the gun. Daxter, just get in, sit down, and shut up. That's the best advice you've ever given Daxter. Here we go. Here we go. Pause. Yep. There's the gun emission, so we'll start this in the next part.